Karen will join us in a moment. First, breaking news. CBS News Colorado has confirmed former Arapahoe County social worker Robin Nicita has been indicted on 10 new criminal charges. That's for allegedly faking a cancer diagnosis to avoid prosecution. Nicita was initially facing charges for allegedly filing a false child abuse report when she was a social worker last year. Investigators said she filed that false report as retaliation against an Aurora City Council person. That person spoke po poorly of Nicita's girlfriend at the time, former Aurora Police Chief Vanessa Wilson. Prosecutors believe Nicita tried to evade criminal proceedings in that case by faking a cancer diagnosis. Now our investigator Katie Weiss has learned it's prompting a host of new charges against her. So Katie, this was a grand jury decision that came down today. Yeah, that's right, McKellia. And actually, court records show that a grand jury with the 18th Judicial District is not only indicting Nicita, mm. but they're also indicting Nicita's mother, Janice Dudley, for her alleged involvement in the fake diagnosis. Now, Court documents show they are both facing charges, including attempting to influence a public servant, tampering with evidence, and forgery. Now, we spoke with Nicita and her mother earlier this spring about her supposed cancer diagnosis, and they provided us these photos of Nicita's alleged brain tumor. You should be seeing them on your screen here shortly. After our story ran, we heard from many people concerned that the photos may have been fabricated. Prosecutors said they, too, then heard from concerned citizens that the cancer diagnosis may may not have been real. That launched a new investigation and prosecutors said when they attempted to contact Nicita's supposed cancer doctor, they determined the doctor may have been fabricated as well. That led to a grand jury review, which handed down the indictments we're seeing today. Now, we tried calling Nicita's mother today for comment, but we have not heard back. And in the meantime, Nicita and her mother have been living in New Mexico. We'll we're told that they'll need to be extradited to Colorado for these new charges. And, McKellia, we'll be sure to let everyone know what happens as soon as we get any new updates. Katie, we know you're all over it. Thank you so much. We appreciate it.